Hi, I'm Chelsea. And I'm Brittany. And this is Girls Night Out, and we're back. We've returned. Oops. Um, today, we're going to be talking about these two products right here. Um, and long arms. Yeah, you got longer arms. Deep, the deep, Suave deep, deep. Conditioner and Shampoo. Um, Chelsea actually... She texted me. She was looking for an affordable shampoo and conditioner that she could use. I didn't want to spend that Shea Moisture money. Mm -mm. Just saying. No, because Shea Moisture money can get you a few meals. But um, I was like, I use the Swa Professionals Natural Infusion, the moisturized one with the white macadamia oil and white orchid. And um, it's very comparable to Pureology. And it smells amazing. It smells like heaven. It's more of a... A musky kind of. It's musky, but it's warm. warm. Yeah, but it's not. We. It's not tooty fruity all right. in your hair. It's but not. it's just that one that smells like. Oh my God, my hair smells good. It's and when a you. Grown woman stay. <laughs> and throughout the day, you you know you take a whiff and like, oh my God, is that my hair? My hair. Smells and I glorious. like the like the shampoo. I wash my hair with the shampoo. When I tell you, I thought I didn't need the conditioner. It leaves your hair so so soft. soft. And deep, with, you can yeah. detangle actually with the shampoo in it. And the conditioner is mm -hmm. just like amazing. It is. And the thing I like about this, it says to moisturize as well as Pureology. I once upon a time worked at Ulta and I have tried Pureology. And usually when I see products that make particular claims like that, it's like, mm -hmm. yeah, it's just the marketing gimmick. But from having tried Pureology and then having used this, I would say that it is very comparable wow. to it. Did that? It, they did, and um, even though it's on the cheaper side, this shampoo actually um, is con more concentrated than you would think. You don't need a big glob of it. A little. When I know you, you might hear me say a lot, a little goes a long way, but I'm not over exaggerating when I yeah. say when you use a product and help you, you know, save it and make it last. A little goes a long, a little goes a long way, and it lather up so quick. My mom, yep. who's has per, she has perm hair, and I have natural hair, it's straight right now. But she used it; she loved it. Mm -hmm. My other friend, I had to braid her hair down because she was getting crochet braids. Her left her hair soft, so it's very versatile. Like it is, and like you, we know, said, you, don't to, you don't have to be natural to um to love this and like or we use said, it. The shampoo really is moisturizing, and as we mentioned, it makes your hair soft. You can actually detangle with it, and when you rinse it out, your hair still feels It's like soft. it has, I mean, the oils in there is just like, it gives you that shine. It gives you that shine, that softness without being super oily, well, without being oily, period, and without weighing it down. And then with the conditioner, because you know us naturals, we love our conditioner. And co-wash. That's why this bit baby is big <laughs> that's right i didn't they didn't have a bigger size of the shampoo but so i need something real quick so they had this it was like maybe two something two dollars two dollars yeah. and then they had this was six maybe 5.97 where did you go i went to walmart you should have called it with the rollback because i got both of my big ones for 4.97 roll back and no that was lame but the conditioner well, it was late at night so i mean <laughs> i had to do the best i just do the best you can yeah but this conditioner it leaves your hair so soft it does the scent releases throughout the day and it's not a super strong overpowering scent that would get on your nerves it just it legit and, no, I, and sometimes good. I just like to wash my hair with it. Yeah. Like, even I'm, though I may have washed it the day before, but I like to go back in and wash it. Yeah, again. like when I do my twist outs, <laughs> I put um, a little in my spray bottle of water and spritz it. And I do the same thing like too. a hair perfume slash leave-in. Um, but if you really want to optimize that good old conditioning, moisturizing property of it, which is perfect on its own, I add a little bit of honey to it. I haven't tried that. The honey is everything. So honey is good for the hair. It's good for the hair. It's Never the heard that. It softens it. Shine. You know what? I take that back because I know I've done like a honey and with with eggs and yogurt or some kind of protein treatment. So sounds like breakfast to me. <laughs> but if you like want to maximize the moisturizing properties of it, totally throw um, a bit of honey in there. I'm gonna try that. Yeah, you and should. And I get back with y'all. Please do. Oh, we should totally do. I've been cleansing my face with honey. That's been my routine. We should routine. do a mask. Yeah. I've been cleansing my face with honey, and it leaves it so soft, and some of my darker spots are lining up. But that's for another video. It is. But um, basically, ladies, if you're trying to not break the bank, save a little bit of money, and get a product that is 
amazing and performs very well. The suave. That's I'm where doing, you want to go. Was it the Kiki Shepard thing? Kiki Shepard, Vanna White, <laughs> Price is Right, right. girl <laughs> thing. But yeah, totally give it a try. And you know, now on to me, you know, the spotlight had to come back on me, you know. Because she called me a yellow princess. I guess I'm the diva, right? Yeah, are you drinking? Clearly because yours is in the wine glass and mine is in a regular glass. So, I know you may have noticed. She cut it all I off. I did. Mm-hmm. Cut off the side. Still natural. Still natural. Still natural. Just wanted a new look. Just wanted a new look. And um, I did this, what, last Saturday? Mm-hmm. So, June 13th. June 13th. Last minute, you know, been talking about it. So, why not? Then a wedding, and um, went to the do salon downtown Cherry Street, and this. She will give you an amazing cut, an amazing style, amazing whatever. I could turn around a little. Well, I guess I try to, you know. Hair but, amazing um, with hair. It's kind of like a mohawk type of cut. And when I tell you, I love it. I've gotten so many compliments on it. It's just something new for me. Um, when I went to transition, I did the big chop, so that was different. I tried out different colors on my hair. I've done the blonde and a brown two-tone thing. Purple, plum. Purple, um, it was more of like an orange, kind of copper color on the ends. So I've been experimenting. So I was like, why not? You know, hair, it grows back. Yeah. So um, I did this, and when I tell you, like, this is like one weekend and my hair is still straight. Like, even though it's like a hundred and 80 degrees outside. It's 100 <laughs> and the precipitation and humidity level. Like, it is ridiculous. Like, I, yeah. th- I saw Satan driving, trying to get a cup of water. That's how yeah, hot it was. It's super hot. Super hot. But just just love it. Like, I tie it up and um, it's time for me, you know, to get it. You no know, trim, went down the sides because my hair does grow fast once you cut it. But other than that, I love it. I can't wait to see when I uh, wash it and do like a twist out. You That's going to be cute. That's going to yeah. be cute. A textured style with that cut. That's really going to be cute. So if you want to try something, do it. You know, do it. Ain't nothing to do, ain't nothing to do, do it. it. I've yeah. got so many compliments. So many, so many like, oh my God, I love it. I do too. Keep putting my hands through it. It's so soft. It is. Feels like heaven. It's cute. Love I always said I'm going to cut mine, but I told my mama I was going to continue yeah, to grow my hair out. Made that. Yeah. Commitment. And sign the contract. But I gave her my word and sometimes I keep it. <laughs> but yeah, basically, but she does have, you know, you have color hair. I got Let's color. talk about Brittany's hair. You we, have with the um, green. It's like a teal color um, in my hair that they that they did. Um, the style is not a product of them, but the color is. And I love it. Um, maintenance is easy. Hair is not dried nor damaged. And I always say, um, sometimes it's better to go and get things professionally done. And the thing I like about your color is not too bright. Mm-hmm. It's very subtle, even though there's a color in it, like a, a not a normal color that you would put in yeah. your hair, but it's, it's not, not a too much given color. <laughs> right, it's not too much, you know. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's picking up on camera or not, but I love it. It's versatile, it's fun, um, it's not too crazy. Makeup works with it. I can still, you know, throw on my bright lip and I don't look yeah. like Ronald McDonald or anything. Wait a minute, but you don't have that bright wig when you're on the hair, so. You can still look like a clown. That is true. That but is I true. don't look like one. <laughs> this next next video, we got to talk about skin tones and what lipsticks that go with that, too, because ladies, mm-mm, mm-mm. Some of y'all be looking like Tyrone Biggums. <laughs> I kid, I kid, I joke, not really. Tyrone. But anyway, this is it for today. You know, we talked about our hair, what we, you know, done to it, did we? An inexpensive product that you should totally try. And if you don't like it, we're sorry, but you can get your me. money back at yeah, Walmart, but you'll like it. You'll love it. You're not going to want to take it back. So just, you know, like our video, subscribe, comment, give us suggestions. If you have any questions, ask them. And we take constructive criticism.